Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, sorry the lighting's really bad in here. Um, it's the only place I have right now to do a video. But I wanted to show you uh, what I'm bringing to the hospital for our baby girl. This is her bag. It's her diaper bag. Um, I'm not really sure how to pronounce the brand of this bag. It's called, I'm going to just pronounce it, Lo Locus? Locus? I still actually have the tag on there. Um, I'll kind of show you around this bag too. But it's kind of cool. Um, there's a zipper here that you can put like some bottles. And it's, it's insulated. And then there's a little mesh right here. And there's another little pocket right here you can put something in and then right on this side there's a place to put wipes and then you can take out wipes through here this side is a place you can put extra bottles or a bottle of your own and let's see in the back has adjustable straps and then stroller straps and another bag with zipper. I think that actually goes into the bag itself. Um, I like bags with zippers and pockets and all that good fun stuff. Alright, inside. It opens up really nice and wide too. And what I have in here for her is, um, this is a little swaddle that it actually comes with a matching headband. And if you saw my video yesterday of what I'm bringing to the hospital, I used to know that I have a matching robe that's like this. I'm sorry that the light is just like horrible in here. But, um, yes, I'm bringing that. And then I'm also bringing a nursing cover and a couple little bibs. Then it comes with this little bag too. And it's, it's insulated. Yes, it's insulated so you can put one of your water bottles or something in there and you can attach it <laughs> it also has this little attachment here I guess you can put your keys on it and then I am bringing three different baby little nighty sleepers I don't know which one she's gonna go home in yet but those are that. It comes with a changing pad, which is very convenient when you're out and you don't really know where you want to change your child if it's a little dirty. So it's January. I'm going to. I have a jacket for her. And another pocket. On the other side, I have diapers. You can see kind of where they are. I have the diapers in here then I have another pocket that has more diapers and this is a pocket has her jacket and then there's another pocket right here that I have little socks and then there's a big pocket right here And there's another pocket way down in the bottom. It has, it's a different material. It's hard to show you. Um, well, here's a blanket that my grandmother made for her. I'm taking that. But then, oops, gotta take these little gel things out. That, <laughs> but there's a um, another. But I don't think you can see it. 
way back in there. It's another little pocket. I guess you can put like wet stuff, like if you get, their clothes get wet. Um, you can put it in there and doesn't get everything else wet. So, I really like this bag. Um, I really wanted this bag. Uh, I, I like that it's a backpack. Um, I had a regular diaper bag when James was a baby. And I, and I really liked it, but I think it's going to be more convenient because I can just have it on my back. And when I'm chasing a toddler and have a infant, I think it's going to be very convenient. And I like that it has one, two, three, four, five, six pockets inside. And then one, two, three on the outside, and then there's two on the side. I like that it has so many pockets and zippers and everything and it's gonna hold quite a bit I believe so oh and a few things that I have not put in her bag yet that I'll be taking to the hospital is um like I said for her little swaddle she has a, a, a matching headband that I need to put in there and I also I'm not sure if I'll bring it a, a newborn hat <clears throat> I realize I don't have a newborn hat for her yet so I'll either need to go pick one of those up before we go. With James, they actually provided two different hats. One was made by little women, uh, little old women who volunteer, and they crocheted one. If they don't end up giving us hats at the hospital, I'll have someone pick one up for us. Scratch mittens. Um, David's going to be picking me up some scratch mittens that you put on the baby's hands so they don't scratch themselves. Um, and also he'll be picking up some diaper rash cream for me, just to be on the safe side. And her pacifiers. I don't have any pacifiers in there yet because they are being sanitized right now. So, but yes, I think everything's going to fit in there just nicely. I hope that I answered some questions either about the diaper bag or what to bring your baby when you go to the hospital all right if you like this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe and hit that bell so you'll never miss any of our videos all right until next time thanks bye